platform to make a move to Amriye, your simp stories. Talk to us. The hashtag again is Thursday Vibes at YT4 channel at Stephanie Ayanta at Color me vow. But now we are on to our first conversation of the day on sport on tech. We are joined by an innovator, not just an innovator, but also an entrepreneur. So we can call him a tech, a techpreneur, right? Uh, welcome, welcome, Francis. Thank you very Francis much. Francis Kamanga. Thank you. I'm Francis uh, Kamanga and I'm an innovator. Okay. Yeah. More about what you do. What what have you innovated? And apart from that, what else do you do? Okay, I've innovated a security gadget mm -hmm. whereby it it secures a room, mm -hmm. whereby if someone tries to enter your room, mm -hmm. the security makes a phone call to the mm -hmm. owner. Mm -hmm. For example, maybe me, mm -hmm. and also it can trigger an alarm mm -hmm. and the security lights. Apart mm -hmm. from that, I do install solar panels. Mm -hmm. uh, we find uh, some of some parts of the country there uh -huh. is no electricity, and uh, you, they can use solar for power. Okay, you're doing quite a lot. Yeah. <laughs> and what are you currently? Are you a student or are you uh, just? Majoring on, uh, you know, your innovation. I I am a student also. Mm -hmm. I'm doing mechatronic oh. at a oh. school called oh. Gearbox Academy. Gearbox Academy. Yeah. So what is mechatronics for those who don't know the course? Okay, mechatronics involves technology of maybe robotics and uh, AI. Yeah. Right. Quite. It sounds very interesting. Are you coming up with anything in AI or in robotics? Um, maybe later, after I'm done with this innovation, I have several innovation that Coming are up. yet to come up. All right. So we want to get into the automatic. The, the security system is an automatic security system, alarm system, right? Yeah. So how is this system? Tell us about this system. How is it different from other alarm systems? Okay, the system is different from the other system because mm -hmm. the system notifies you immediately when someone tries to enter your room mm -hmm. and also the system can call you at any particular part of the country maybe mm -hmm. your home is located in Mombasa and you're in Nairobi the same system will call you mm -hmm. despite the distance okay yeah. quite interesting so we'll take a look at how the system works because we don't we have we don't have it here but we have a prototype video of how it works which we will be playing right right about now my director will be playing it so as uh, the video comes on uh maybe you can tell us how did you come about this okay why mm. i came up with this system mm -hmm. uh i was told my chickens were stolen back in 2019 mm -hmm. and uh, i decided to create a system mm -hmm. that can notify me if someone tries to enter my room or try to steal something from me i'm able to know that person is taking something from me Okay, we'll get back to that, but first let's play the video. Let's see how it works. My name is Francis Kamanga. I have a project under the category engineering. I'm going to show you how it works in a short while, which is called automatic door alarm. When I open this door, there are some effects that are going to occur. The the bulbs right itself, the motor, the same. An alarm sound is produced. It's eight hours. Al an alarm sound is also produced. And when I close all these stops, And also, it makes for, makes a phone call, as you can see. Well, there's so much into the video. You'd want to go and uh, look at it later on. Francis, tell us what can they get because this is from your channel. Yeah, they can mm. go to YouTube and mm. search Francis Kamanga. Mm. They are going to see the video 
very okay. well. Yeah. Okay, and this is the prototype. This is not the actual thing. So yeah. Someone might wonder, Nita, let's hear you when you hear, you know. But that is the prototype. You actually fix yeah. it in the house. Yeah. So tell us about the process. So how does it, you know, how does it look inside the house? Okay. Uh, inside the house, it's just a small structure. Mm -hmm. uh, even uh, maybe a thief will not notice there is a security gadget, mm -hmm. and uh, the system mm -hmm. uh, it sends movement and mm -hmm. also the body temperature of someone. Mm -hmm. That's why it's able to detect if someone tries to steal. And uh, I decided to come up with this system using temperature and the motion because someone might not go through the door. Maybe wow. he would break the, the roof and enter the house. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it's not necessarily someone coming in through the door when it may as well, is it? Yeah. So any, anything, as in any intrusion, yeah. it will notice because of the temperature and, you know, the movement. Yeah. Again. So it's very safe, very yeah. reliable. Yeah. Ah, back to how you came up with it. You are trying to solve your own problem. Yeah. <laughs> and and uh, uh, I would say maybe innovation is intentional because uh, um, if I did not, if my chickens were not stolen, mm -hmm. I would now not have come up with that idea, mm -hmm. all this innovation. Wow. Yeah. So now, uh, you were, when, you, when your chickens were stolen, I understand that you were still in high school? Yeah, I was in high school. Uh -huh. Yeah. Form? I was in uh, Form 3. Mm -hmm. yeah. So did you have, I'm struggling to understand how you came up with this system. Did you have an IT background or any background in tech? No, but I used to participate in something called science and technology. And uh, most of the time I was making projects so that I can go outside the school. But mm -hmm. I didn't know this project was that big and maybe it would give me a, a revenue rate. It will give me money. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So you just came up with it to solve your own problem, and now you're making money from it. Yeah. Did you do? You, did you receive any support, or have you? Are you receiving any support from the government for the startups? You know. Yeah, I'm receiving support from the government, mm. especially the county government of Kiambu. It is supporting young innovators and uh, entrepreneurs in oh. starting their own business whereby you can go to the bank and uh, borrow a loan without any security at 7%. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Yeah. Wow, quite interesting. And how's your story, uh, you know, how did the, I know you've met with the ICT uh, CS, and how is this supporting you? Okay, the CS Joe Moshero has been, uh, has been helping me for a couple of time. Mm -hmm. I met him in 2020 in October. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and uh, I was in high school that time. And he came to our home and saw the innovation. Wow. Yeah. Uh, do, are you receiving any support from him? Yeah. Okay. That's quite, that's quite nice. And back to the system again. So now, uh, is it being adopted now that you're selling it to the public after, you know, it came to be known? How, how is it being received by the public? Yeah, it's been received well. And uh, actually, people don't believe that that project is working and uh, they come to my home and uh, yeah. see it and uh, <laughs> they say this is magic yeah <laughs> it's amazing in, in in our maze yeah ah wow wonderful how many have you been able to sell approximately about 10 uh -huh. yeah and, and what's the demographic most people are they coming from your area or no it's not necessary our area it's scattered mm -hmm. yeah okay so you have people from all over Kenya coming yeah. to, okay, that's nice. So now back to how it works. Now we have the alarm. I know that there's a way you can regulate the sound. Tell us about, you know, that process. Okay. Okay. You can uh, maybe reduce the sound mm -hmm. using something called a uh, dimmer switch whereby you can decide the system can be silent and uh, the system also can make a phone call when it's silent. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. So now uh, when the system makes a phone call, because now when the intruder comes into the home, it start, the alarm goes off, right? 
Yeah, sorry. When some when an intruder comes to the the homestead or yeah. the house, the alarm uh, goes out. Yeah. And then now it makes a call. Yeah. So after making the call, now what happens after I've picked the call? Uh, if you pick the call, you can listen to what they are saying, and uh, probably the thief might say, uh, to me, Baba, acha to see, to end to the future Mahari, to kuja to chukua bada. You can go there with the police and wait for them. Aha. Uh-huh. Yeah. Also, that's how it helps when you, it's just listening in. Yeah. Okay, and now, so what if someone is too far? Maybe so now they make plans to call the police and <laughs> yeah. do that. But now, uh, does it hold any, does it have any evidence? Because if someone doesn't talk, maybe it's... So the thief comes alone, Just it's just the movement, him stealing and all that. How do you... Oh, the system also mm. has cameras. Maybe you can uh, look at the footage of the thief so okay the system has cameras but you have to come to the house to check the camera or does no. it send to your phone no if your home is connected with wi-fi you can be able to mm. watch through your phone mm-hmm. so yeah. it sends you a link yeah aha uh-huh. wow this that is quite interesting <laughs> any in other innovation that you've come up with apart from this particular one uh not yet i have but uh maybe i'll I will do it later. later on. Yeah. Uh-huh. And any advancements that you intend to make in uh, the security alarm system? Okay. Uh, my advancement to the security system, I would like to connect it with a smartphone device mm-hmm. whereby you will have an app. You mm-hmm. can control the system using a phone call. Maybe you can uh, switch the alarm. Maybe, maybe like that. And mm-hmm. also, I would like to. Mm-hmm to to partner with the maybe people who do vehicle security system whereby mm-hmm. they can use my system and uh, the system can be used in also in vehicles mm-hmm. yeah okay uh, before we uh, get done with the story of the security alarm system as you tell us the other things you do I understand that the alarm works differently at night sure how so uh, sorry? how does it work differently at night? Uh, it worked the same during oh. the day and night, yeah. Oh, all right. I thought yeah. there were some lights maybe coming on because it's dark, maybe outside or something. Uh, it's mm. it's still the same. Uh, during the day also the lights will go on and also ah. during the night the also lights will go on. So the lights go on at both times of the day? Yeah, and uh, I made it like that. The lights goes on and uh, muzi ya tafikiria, maybe kuna mtu wame, mgoja, hame akisha tu stima ni akukamate. Ah, yeah. alright. <laughs> so, so, apart from this, what else do you do as we come to a close on this conversation? Okay, I do Wi-Fi installation mm-hmm. and uh, also I do solar for farming whereby you connect solar with a pump and maybe you can pump water into your farm and irrigate your crops. So how do you collect, connect sorry, the solar with the pump and farm, you know, distribute the farm? Is this an innovation by you or is it something that is already there? It's something that's already there mm-hmm. and uh, people do not know about solar can pump water or something like to do like that, yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah. So, so, what is your final word, maybe that you can say to the innovators, or something that you want to add, maybe we have not touched on as we come to a close. Okay, what I would like to tell an innovator or someone who is doing something, uh, maybe I would say innovation or what you're doing is just a journey. You have to keep working and uh, balancing what you do, and never give up. And never give up. Yeah. Wow. So we, you're making use of your you, your hands, your skills. Yeah. And why is that very important for you? Okay. Uh, it's very important for me because uh, what I'm doing, it gives me funding to do what I want. I don't have to depend on another person for money. Yeah, I depend on myself. Okay. Where can we get you on social media again? Okay, you can find me on uh, Facebook, Francis Njoroge, or on Facebook still, Skynet Kamanga. 
yeah and uh, also on youtube francis kamanga mm -hmm. yeah thank you very much for coming on board and sharing with us your innovation we wish you the best in it thank you all right, so that has been Francis Kamanga, who's the founder of Skynet. Kamanga, that is his company, and he has come up with an automatic uh, security alarm system. So much brains in it. We celebrate our innovators. That's uh, what we have for you in Sport on Tech. Kalamival will be coming up next with music and lifestyle after this short break. <laughs>